Good morning, everybody, and welcome to Visit Fail Coast. You're probably wondering where on earth I am now. Well, I'm in Fleetwood, and this is the work that's starting at the new Project Neptune at the dock. So I'm just going to orientate you and show you where we are, because I bet you're wondering. So this is the Three Lights pub, which is on the edge of the A585, which is the main road coming down into Fleetwood. This is the road into the dock. That's the wind turbine at Jamieson Road. And this is into the commercial fish dock. So just at the back of there is where the fish processing takes place. We'll, we'll, we'll have a little walk around there in a second, but I'm just trying to kind of give you the gist of where we are. So these are all these are all the sheds where they do the fish auctions and, and the the trading and whatnot. So there's there's a big shed there where vehicles park and whatnot. I'm trying to I'm trying to slot this between the, the fence and that one straight in front of us there you can see it's the fish auction hall. And there is actually still quite a big fish market in Fleetwood albeit most of the fish, would you believe, is trucked here by road. Not, not delivered by boat. Plenty of seagulls, all after the fish, all after the fish. We'll go above the, we'll go above the fence and then you can see things better. That's better. Right, so what's happening? Well, this is new commercial space and improvements to the dock. So it was actually the 12th of December, sorry, no, it wasn't the 12th of December, it was the 12th of January 2021 when we were last here and it was absolutely bitterly cold. So we've gone from one extreme to another and today it's enough to fry you. And it's only about 10 o'clock and it's absolutely boiling. But work, as promised, has started, as you can see. And they've got all the floor marked out down here with blue paint so that you can well, they can see what they're doing. I'm not quite sure if we can tell you. That's the A585 in the background where you can see the cars at the back of the fence. Um, I can hear somebody pile driving. This is obviously a piling rig straight in front of us. And that building right in front of us with the, the apex on, on this flat end is the end of the ice house. Um, so the work obviously is being done in and around this area and with this long building that's at the back of that white quayside lorry. So we're gonna we're gonna take a little walk around onto the road now and then you can you can get a better look. So this is the workman's site compound. Um, so so why council has got four million from the government's getting building fund. Um, which is the same fund that's actually paying for the refurbishment of the Abingdon Street Market project, which coincidentally I've just I've just put online this morning on our Live Blackpool website. So it's the land between the ice house and the three lights. So it's that plot that we've just been looking at, and the groundworks are gonna gonna continue now until it's it's finished and they're building new commercial units for fish processing um demolishing potentially some outdated buildings there's enabling infrastructure carrying on to remediate unstable land and they're improving surface access for future housing projects can't believe the difference last time when we came around here it was enough to paralyze you it was freezing and now we've got all the lavender out on flowering. So this is the entrance into the into the dock area and these buildings that you can see down here, they're the fish processing sheds and, and where they, they deal deal fish and stuff and whatnot. That's the road there that takes you into the Harbourside village. So if you follow that road it takes you to the, the, the housing development that you can see from Affinity. Nearly called it Freeport then that would be bad won't it? So this is the Three Lights pub, which as you can see is relatively new. Um, and we're gonna take a little walk onto a mountainous way and just look at it from the other side. 
because I think it's interesting not just to know what's happening you can see how there's no wind look the turbines stood stock still it's interesting to see what's happening and it's interesting to look back on it and see just how much everything's changed this is this is freedom week as we're videoing this and and obviously it's quite early in the morning so although the pubs open if that makes sense it's not open if you follow my logic it's too early for the pub to be open today but it is open look at the flowers this this tangle of roses and bindweed and all kinds of different things in fact i can hear the crickets it's absolutely full of bugs and beasties and wildlife and whatnot So that's a mountainous way, the mighty road that we all troop into Fleetwood on. So that way is up towards Morrison's roundabout and the direction that you come in from the motorway. Um, and as we get around this corner, you'll see where we are because this is the direction to the town centre. So Affinity is next on our right and then from there onwards you carry on round the course road until eventually you get to the sea front. Just get past these bushes and you'll be able to see see what there is to see. This is a really busy road <laughs> as you can see. It's always busy. It's main main thoroughfare into Fleetwood. So this is um, Oh, just looking at all this grass is making me want to sneeze. If I start sneezing, you'll know why. This is the plot of land that's being redeveloped for the, the new Project Neptune fish dock. You can see it a bit better from this side, albeit the traffic's a lot noisier. I can still hear the crickets chirruping away in this grass. I bet you can't hear them. Right, so there you go, you see, you can see, you can see even better still now. It's quite a big site, isn't it? And they're also as well doing some work, I think it's over that end, to improve the key. So they're removing an old suspended key to enable construction of a natural revetment and they're demolishing existing warehouses to create car parking space. So you can see at that end actually that they're just starting to take the, the buildings down. So this lot will be demolished and they're building a new food processing park with new buildings, car parks, servicing, waste provision, all the usual stuff that you need when, when you're doing stuff. In fact, these these metal things where the, the guys are stood there. They're new, I'm sure they weren't there. Let's go a little bit further and we'll go and see. And in fact, that's what the piling rig's putting in, is it not? Yes, there's a pile of them on the floor and that's what the piling rig's doing, I reckon. Oh, we do like a building site. We do like a building site. We like to know, we like to know how everything's done. It's all those years of watching through the window on play school that does it. Somebody up there in a looks like a gyrocopter. Oh goodness, that's a bit high up. I'm not sure what they are. Any ideas anybody? Oh they're these look. They're um, concrete concrete legs of some description. There you go, look, he's lifting it up. It's going to make it vertical and then knock it in. They're amazing, these rigs. Knock, knock, knock. So they usually, oh, that's a proper vibrating one. They, they quite often will push, depending on the ground that they're working on and the type of rig and what they're putting in, they'll quite often push as far as they can and then knock the rest of the way. Oh, 
always waving at us. You're on, you're on candid camera, mate. <laughs> Smile, you're on candid camera. Fascinating. They'll be coming over here in a minute, you can bet, wanting to know what I'm doing. Mm, all interesting stuff. So that's affinity there. This is the ice house. This first building on the left. And then just beyond that, you can't actually see the building from here, but you can see the sign and the car park. That's where affinity is. Which is where we're going next. So I hope you've enjoyed that little update. We'll continue to bring you some of us. When, uh, when there's a little bit more building going off, we'll come back and we'll do some more. So don't forget to make sure that you've subscribed to Visit File Coast on YouTube and take that little bell for notifications. I think these two are getting twitchy. <laughs> I think they're wondering why I'm filming. <laughs> um, and then uh, you'll get notifications when we do all kinds of interesting things from interesting places. You have a lovely day and we'll see you soon. Bye for now.